OMG, what? Follow E. OMG, who? Follow E. OMG, yeah, follow E. Oh, who that be? Hell, that be me. Follow E. What's up, OMG? Gang, 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 gang. What is going on out there in YouTube world today, baby? Y'all, let me get a little comfortable for y'all so y'all can see me a little bit better because I'm trying to let y'all be able to see the food and everything. So today, we are starting off by congratulating all the parents, aunties, grandparents, uncles, cousins, anybody that's taking care of kids, whether they are theirs or not. We would like to say, I would like to say, I love you, appreciate you, I adore you, I thank you so much for all that you do to be able out here to afford and provide for the kids to get them some of the things that we are able to provide for them. I just like to tell you how much I thank you so much. Okay, y'all, today we are going to have salt grass. I have never been to salt grass before, but this is a place that I wanted to try and I'm giving this a light review because this was requested that I try this so I'm giving it a light review because it's just on the appetizer menu so I will be going back to do a meal for a full review but this is just a light review this time because of someone telling me about it. So I decided to take my lunch today and come and do this for you guys. So let's get our prey on. Thank the Lord for this food that we're about to receive. Let it be nourishing to my body and strengthen my health. In Jesus' name, amen. Man, that's what's going on today, y'all. So we're not going to waste no time because I am on my lunch and I want to get this in. But I also want you to check out my video that I did with Smooth Vlogs at Crab Barack. I want y'all to check, check, check it out. Okay. We're going to get out eat up. I ain't using, um, I'm using my regular thing. Your regular? <laughs> I'm not putting no gloves on. I mean, what other fingers do we have? <laughs> You know what I mean? I wouldn't put them on either. I feel like uh, let's get holding down really and dirty Jesus. up in here. Mm -hmm. Yes, down and dirty with this him, baby. Okay. We got some extra butter. I'm doing Stella. I, I got I gotta get my groove back. <laughs> what you drinking? Right now just the mountain dew. She's mounting and doing it right mm -hmm. now. Okay. For now. And I'm going in on this muscle, baby. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. Sausage, shrimp, sausage, shrimp, cabbage, potato, corn. That muscle off the jam. We got crawfish, mussels, crab legs, corn, potato. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. This is the house seasoning, the house sauce with everything I think. It is delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Wait a minute, y'all. Mmm. Mmm. And they got like a perfect amount of spice. Mm-hmm. Y'all know me and I'm not to talk about, but. <laughs> Get distracted real fast. Real fast on this one. Y'all, please check out her channel. Yes, please do. Stand yes. behind them. Everything. Mm. And the funny thing about it, them, we got in here. Now, waitress' name is Erica. Her nickname is Peaches. And that's my name both times. <laughs> And I know her, and I didn't even know. And her. she know her. Peach's name was Erica. She didn't know it. I just knew about Peaches. So I went, Erica, this is Peaches. And they both was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> and she went, no, I'm Erica. She was like, no, I'm Erica. <laughs> <laughs> okay y'all i'm back and we're gonna do salt grass like i said okay let's see what we got going on in here today up in this lunch time i know we got a little bag i don't know what's in that i know i got me a caesar salad i know what's in that 
Oh, that looks so good. That looks so good. Mm. Maybe that's a thumbnail. Maybe it's not. But what we do have on this menu is what was asked for me to try is, and I'm going to pronounce it correctly. Let me get my silverware. Get all of that out. I wish they would have let me mix up my own salad, but hey, hey, it all good. This is called bacon wrap quail legs. And it consists of jalapeno cream cheese, sriracha honey with fried onions. So let's go ahead. This is not the best presentation because guess what? It is in a to-go box. So let's go ahead. Okay, there we go. So, y'all, this looks great, don't it? And this is not onions. These are like Brussels sprouts down at the bottom. Let me taste that. Mm -mm. Okay, this is like a shredded Brussels sprout. And the crust is delicious. I could have ate a plate there. Mm -mm. Let me get my Caesar salad taste on. Mm. Okay. This is just a regular little season. Nothing big to talk about, but it got the Parmesan pieces on them. Um, that's all that really matters. I have water to drink <clears throat> because I drink water all day long at home. But we're not going to prolong this quail, okay? I'm going to buy this salad. This will not be a long video. Okay. Mmm. Look like you get five delicious looking quail thingies. But here come the tail. Mmm. Oh my god. Can you see it in there? I got the hot peanut pepper. The cream cheese. Can you see it? Okay. Well, anyway. Mmm. 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 That's delicious. That is really delicious. I love it. Baby, I'm cleaning this him. Like I do them um tips, baby. This is the little one. Okay. <laughs> Quail I am. Y'all. That's delicious. If that little bit of food right there is good, I wonder what the rest of it tastes like. I will be trying them again. I also will be doing the Nook's Redemption because I didn't get the right order. So I'm giving them the Redemption for the next time. 
So hoping I can get that in before the week over with. It's just been hard to do like my car, car milk bangs because it's really been raining here. Huh? And if you can see, it's really not that sunny. Mm, mm, mm. That right down. That's delicious. That that car, y'all. I got some work done on. I had to get brakes. I went ahead and got the oil changed, so I won't have to worry about that getting off one day at work. Or worry about doing the weekend. I had to get a headlight. Dad decided he want to go out. So I got all that done. I still got to find out why this knocking is going down. I'm going to take that to the dealership, though. I went to Goodyear in Midfield. Over by the pig and Midfield. Anybody that know about Midfield area, y'all know what I'm talking about. This is good. I don't know. How they handcraft this? Did they make them there at the job, or are these pre-made? But whatever, it's good. And the bacon is easy and even with the meat. It's not like you just tasting bacon. You actually tasting the flavor of the quail and everything. It's delicious. Mm, mm, mm. You must get all the meat. Anyway, today is Wednesday. Y'all probably want to see this the Thursday. I'm going to try to do videos Sunday through Friday, but I might miss some in between, but those are going to be my main days. I'm not going to too much worry about Saturday because I can do videos on Saturday, maybe one or two videos on Saturday, but kind of like get the week started. I'm still going to film. So, it's all good. I have two this weekend to do. So, it's all good. Y'all, please check out Smooth Vlogs. Y'all seen what we um was at um, Crab or Rat. Please check out Smooth Vlogs. Please check out A Sincerely A Lucy. And check out Fool Belly. Oh, let me see what's in here. Oh, it's a nice little piece of bread. I don't eat bread. Not like that. Y'all, y'all, y'all. And y'all know um, when I do food review, I said I wasn't going to come up with like a lot of content, but... I came up with a few because I am doing lunch, but this is a food review. And I won't be doing this. But I don't know when I'll be able to talk about these few things. So, I want to say R.I.P. to Janet Dubose, um, also known as Wilona. She also played on... Um, she played on Good Time. She played on um, 
What is it, brother? Give me a high five. When the Wayans, she played on them. She played on Martin. Players ball. Um, she was 74 years old. And she died in her sleep. She had three children. Surviving children. She had three of them. So rest in peace to her. I think like my favorite show with her is when um, they invited, um, um, Flo invited uh, whatever her name is over because they found out she was eating dog food. And so Malona came over to eat because she had burnt her food. And when she found out that the lady brought the... Um, the meatloaf, oh my gosh, the way she got up out of them. It was just fun. Y'all, this little bird right here will give you life. It was just fun. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> that little quail was excellent. I'm talking about, oh my God. It was delicious. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. All right. My other team. Okay. However, I know y'all get tired of seeing this jacket, but this is what I wear. It be so cold and work. I bit my lip. It hurt. Right in the front. Anyway. So... Neo is getting a divorce from his wife, allegedly. Okay. However, she's not wasting any time because she's out with Ryan Henry with Black Ink Chicago. So, people are ragging her for moving on. All right, I feel that that's unfair. I feel like the lady has a right to move on because we don't know what day they even broke up, what point they had even broke up. He could be seeing somebody. He's just not making it public. But the way he did his baby mama, he basically just left her for him. So, I mean, you reap what you sow. I don't feel is no different than what Brad and Angelina did. I just don't feel it's any difference. They both did what they did, and it is what it is. So, I don't really care. But the lady can move on if she wants to. She don't have to wait a certain amount of time if she don't want to. Because people be in relationship and don't feel out of love with each other, ain't even touching each other or none of that. And they continue happy and they move on just as easily and fair because they have come to an agreement and they fine with their agreement. I mean, it is what it is.
And that might be where they are. So we can't jump to conclusions. Thinking like they so cool still or, or still in love and stuff. That just might not be true. He might be okay with her moving on. Trust me. There's some people that are very, very okay with that. So, anyway, I'm going to end this video after I say this last little thing. Y'all know how I feel about this man. All right, Kelly, I can't. I just can't keep on with you, I kill him. You have another young girl that was at the age of 14 that is now telling that she had been messing around with R. Kelly for about three years since she was 14 years old. And so now he is basically got handed down some more indictments of new sexual abuse victim and they're not mentioning it mention that person um but the illinois charge in additional another five counts of indictments in new york to which kelly plead not guilty in august he's pleading not guilty again even to this even to the new charges he is pleading not guilty so this is not looking good for our kelly it really, really isn't, and I guess he's gonna fight. Oh, excuse me, but you know when you eat something, might fly out your mouth. I guess he's gonna fight this to the end. So, big ups to our killer for fighting this to the end. I'm proud of you because if you feel that you were not right, you feel that you're right then the best thing for you to do is take up for yourself. It makes sense. Perfectly good sense. All right. Y'all, I want y'all to like, subscribe, hit that bell button, comment down below. Y'all need to come and try the bacon wrap quail. I co-sign that 100%. It's delicious. Um, I will be trying some more stuff from here. So it won't just be on this video um as a food review this is a small food review dealing, dealing with this appetizer that somebody told me i need to try so this is a little review but when i do a meal that's gonna be a bigger review i don't want to just shut them down over appetizer so like subscribe hit that bell button come in down below and come back follow omg what follow e omg who follow e OMG, yeah, follow eat now. Who that be here? That be me. Peace.